The Zala Lancet is an unmanned aerial vehicle and loitering munition developed by Russian company Zala Aero Group, part of Kalashnikov concern, for the Russian armed forces. It was first unveiled in June 2019 at the ARMY 2019 Military Expo in Moscow. It is a further development of the Zala KYB UAV loitering munition. The Zala Lancet can be used for both reconnaissance and strike missions. It has a maximum range of 40 kilometers, 25 miles, and a maximum takeoff weight of up to 12 kilograms, 26 pounds. In combat mode, it can be armed either with high explosive or HE fragmentation warheads. It features optical electronic guidance and TV guidance unit, which allows the munition to be controlled during the terminal stage of flight. The drone features intelligence, navigation, and communications modules. According to Zala Aero Chief Designer Alexander Zakharov, the Lancet can be used in so-called air mining role. In this role, the drone dives at maximum speed up to 300 km per hour, 190 miles per hour, and strikes enemy unmanned combat aerial vehicles mid-flight. Lancet can be launched via catapult launcher from ground or sea platforms like the Raptor-class patrol boats. The drone is powered by an electric motor. Russian troops in Ukraine have begun using the upgraded Lancet loitering munitions with an increased flight duration of one hour, and a more powerful warhead weighing more than 5 kilograms, which is at least 2 kilograms more than the basic version of the drone. Lancets are used to attack personnel with a high explosive fragmentation or thermobaric warhead, and armored vehicles with a high explosive anti-tank warhead. The upgraded variant is designated as Delhi 51, while the original one, with a 3 kg warhead, is designated as Delhi 52 and reportedly was upgraded with a larger warhead and a new EO guidance system, as of March 2023. Russia says 45% of NATO artillery, Inc. M777S, single-handedly destroyed by Lancet, three kamikaze drones, Russian Lancet. Three drones have destroyed nearly 45% of towed and self-propelled artillery guns from NATO, since the beginning of the war in February 2022. The report was given by Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shugu during a video conference with Russia's senior military leadership on April 4. The report highlights the use of loitering munitions, which has dramatically evolved from the 2020 Nagorno-Karabakh conflict to the battle in Ukraine. Ukrainian troops have pioneered using civilian and leisure drones for military purposes by strapping them with explosives and dropping them into enemy positions. According to Shugu, the Russian military destroyed 59 M777 artillery systems, 13 M109 Paladin SBGs, 14 US-made HIMARS launchers, and 30 SBGs from Poland, Germany, France, and the Czech Republic since January 1, 2023. The post also reveals that Lancet drones destroyed 80% of the M109 Paladin self-propelled guns, and 25% of the M777 guns out of the total number of such guns destroyed. Lancet 3 drones, also known as kamikaze or suicide drones, were used to eliminate the need for long-range guns, rocket artillery, and the supply lines that feed them. The report further states that drone piloting is emerging as an in-demand trade, and Russian units are being equipped with specialized training in operating unmanned aerial vehicles for commercial, civilian, and specialized military purposes. The Lancet 3 drone is reported to have evolved, with a new electro-optical system, improved software, and a more powerful warhead that makes it possible to reliably hit howitzers, tanks, armored vehicles, radars, air defense systems, and enemy manpower. The drone comes with three types of warheads, cumulative, high-explosive fragmentation, and thermostatic.